Hello and welcome to episode 4 of my Minecraft Let's Play. Um, as you can see, I've done a little bit since the last episode. Uh, I made a valuables chest with all my good stuff in it. And I made a couple of TNT because I've got enough gunpowder. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. Anyways, I got a suggestion from one of my was the last episode to uh, start telling stories in my episodes because... As you know, I'm not very good at talking. <laughs> and, to be honest, I have absolutely no idea what to talk about, as in story-wise. But, I was told to be creative, so... Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, stories usually go well if you just improvise along. So, I'm gonna think of something random. <laughs> This is the story of how a young man in Minecraft got to be how he was. As you can see, he still has a creeper t-shirt on from quite a while ago. <laughs> it's probably my favourite skin, just the normal dude in the thing. Anyways, once upon a time there's a little dude. He spawned on a strange island right next to a cave. And there were lots of strange animals and mobs nearby. He was treated differently because he was different to the rest of them. He was picked on for it most, most of the time. You got some people who are quite nice, like these chickens in the water over here. They were quite good to him. And there's an egg in the water. So <laughs> there's an egg in the water apparently. Ugh, wet eggs. Lovely stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, yeah, some mobs were really nice to him, and they left him little presents, like eggs in the water. <laughs> and some of them, some of them were not so nice to him. He was picked on a lot. So this is the story of how he overcame those morons. And how I managed to get a cat in my room while I'm recording. <laughs> now, seriously, I do have a cat in my room right now. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, back to the story. This young man, he spawned right next to a cave. And he decided to build himself a little base in there. And while digging, he discovered a little pond nearby. And he decided to make it his storage room. Well, hopefully, none of the mobs will steal his stuff. But, as you know, some of the mobs on here aren't so nice. So, yeah. And one day, the zombies got a bit too much for the poor little dude. He got cornered one day and he ended up dead. In fact, he's died several times on this map, but, uh, you know. <laughs> That's because of my failure. But anyways, the dude said, enough is enough. I'm gonna go kick their sorry ass into next week. Or into space where they can't breathe and they'll die. So what he decided to do, he decided to go down into the cave with a hefty sword. And he's gonna go kick their ass. So that's what he's decided to do right now. So we're gonna get down there. Oh, okay. Oh, it's here, sorry. We're gonna go see if we can find some zombies. Particularly the ones that were getting really annoying. So... Zombies, he said. Where are you? I'm going to kick your butt. While picking up some valuable minerals. Like this gold up here. It's kind of cool. But there's only one there though. Oh no, oh, 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 might be a good amount. Yeah, five, not too bad. But anyways, eventually he got a bit bored of trying to look for zombies to go kick. So what he decided to do instead was cheat and use the, the system, which Notch still hasn't fixed which is good, of locating enemies by using F3.
So somewhere about, he said, there's gotta be some people I can kill. And as you can see up there, there are. So, yeah. As you can see, I've got explosives. And there's a zombie up there, so he's gonna get what's coming to him. Come over here, he said. I have popsicles for you. <laughs> did that kill you? He said, yes. Yes, it did. Said the zombie, even though he was dead already. <laughs> so he was really happy about kicking that zombie's ass. In fact, he said, why don't we go kick some more butt? Because it's funny. His mind and his heart agreed. They all wanted to kick the zombies' butts. So that is exactly what he was going to do. So we got up into a dark area with a little bit of light source. Where are you? He said. Where are you? I'm going to kill you. There he is! You're gonna come down here! I got more popsicles for it! Oh, he's... Is it me or is he getting faster? <laughs> Anyways, come over here, he said. I have plenty of things for you to have. Come down to my basement. He almost touched me. You can't give me hugs anymore! And as you can see, he said, I kicked his sorry butt into next week. Yeah! And as a reward, he found some gold, and it looks like quite a good amount. And that, my friends, is the story of how my little man on Minecraft came from nothing, and he decided to be a big man. <laughs> uh, that was quite possibly the stupidest thing I've ever done, but anyways, I oh, hope you enjoyed that, because half the time I didn't know what to say, <laughs> and I was improvising, so yeah. I may get some negative comments about that story, because it was kind of random, and I have never done it before, and I've never had any practice, or had any script written out, because having script written out makes it more boring. If you improvise, you come up with all sorts of wacky stuff, which is always better. So anyways, this episode, this episode, this episode, this episode, what are we going to do? Well, first of all, I'm going to get back up, because that's what I need to do while getting more lights. And, hello, he said, there are more gold. And uh, somehow, somehow I need to get back. I, I think I may have, oh, oh no, stop here. No, don't mind, don't mind. Scratch that. Oh, it, it, stop it. Plenty of these little babies up on the way. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god! Oh, there's another skeleton. I mean, zombie. I'm gonna kick his butt and all. Yeah. And then what we're gonna do? We're gonna get out. I'm gonna smoke my valuables, and we're gonna put them in the chest along with the other valuables. So, yeah. Anyways, I think, I think what I'm going to do next is uh, make a farm. I think a farm would be appropriate. I, need to, I think there's an achievement I need to get. Oh. Yeah. I need to make a hole. Make up with the whole hole. So, yeah. <laughs> so let's get back up. It's probably night time again, so... And it is, as it usually is. Anyways, I I have no coal. Why? Wow. That's rare. 
I normally have tons of it. So we're going to go down here. We're going to get some coal. Hmm. Okay, maybe down here then. Funny how you, when you want coal, it's never there. It's it's annoying. <sighs> oh, here we go. Good stuff. Good. Oh. Ugh. Bloody gravel. I hate gravel. And sand for that matter. Except with sand you can make sandstone, so that sort of makes up for it. Oh. Oh. Is that ground level? No, it isn't. Okay, so we've got some coal. We're going to get back up. We are going to smelt this. Put it in the chest. And we're going to get on with probably making the foundations of my farm. I think I've got plenty of buckets to use. So, yeah. Let's shove these in it. I think I might make some lights while I'm at it. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. Um, so, yeah. Let us get out in the night. I'm probably going to die. I'm not going to like me. Actually, I'm going to go... Okay. <laughs> okay, I just went through the door. As in, through the door. That was kind of strange. I suppose it's not the first time it's happened, though. No. It's happened plenty of times but before. Let's shove these in there. Uh, we're going to... Put the sand in here. We've got plenty of glass. I could make a greenhouse. See that? I think that's a good idea. Um, I'll try to use wood, wood and glass, or cobble and glass to make a farm or a greenhouse. Or I could just use glass by itself. Hmm. I'll tell you what. I'll leave that till the next episode, and you can leave your suggestions in the comments area. Um. What material will, will go well with glass to make sort of a greenhouse? It has to be quite a large greenhouse, otherwise the farm inside it will be quite small. Because I'm going to try and get a uh, sugar cane, uh, or reeds, or whatever they're called. We'll put them in there as well. So it's going to be like a big farm, like... I think you should be able to grow cocoa beans. That's one of my suggestions to notch. Instead of just finding them in dungeon chests, which, to be honest, not one of the chests have it in there, so it's... What's annoying when you find a dungeon and there isn't any cocoa beans in there? And it's also annoying when you get zombies interrupt your recording. Shut up! You gonna wish you had said that. You interrupted my story and now I'm gonna interrupt your laugh. Huh? Where is he? It is getting... Yes, it is getting light. Good stuff. There's a skeleton over there. Hello, my dear. How would you like to come over here? Oh, my God. Oh, get in. Oh, get, get, get. There we go. Shoot you through my door. That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> ha! Easy to this stuff. Well, anyways, back to the glass. Uh, yeah. What material do you think would best go with glass? Cobble? Uh, solid stone? Sand? Wood? Anything. Maybe even brick. I don't know. I've never actually used brick before. So I've never been bothered to um, smoke the clay. Mainly because it takes A, a long time, and B, a lot of coal. So, yeah. So, um. I've run out of things to do on this episode, actually. <laughs> yeah, I need, to, I need to get some renovation done. It's getting a bit boring it looking like one thing all the time. So actually, let's do that quickly. Cool. Oh, there's a zombie. Pesky little tiger. You're going to die. Oh, he died in front of me. Suck on that. Let's grab some of this. And probably any episode to finish this. Uh, let's have a look at that. There we go. Guess I could make something over there. If I sort of uh, flatten the land over there by that birch tree. Could make something over there. 
And I have some sort of extending pathway into the water. I don't know. It's up to you guys. I'm going to leave it pretty much up to you to what I can do on this uh, Let's Play series. Any suggestions would be much appreciated. So, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and end the episode there. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you enjoyed my random story. Though it was kind of rubbish in my terms. I didn't think it was too good for my first time of telling random stuff. So, yeah. <laughs> Oops, a daisy. Let's chuck that in there. I'm going to chuck these two in here. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you very much for watching, and I shall see you on the next episode of the Minecraft Let's Play. Goodbye.